Welcome back everyone to another video. I just want to say thank you guys for all the support that you guys give us. We're almost at 1200 subscribers. Let's smash the subscribe button and let's get to 5000 subscribers. But today's video, we actually got something pretty exciting. Let's see what's within this box. I got pretty excited to show you guys the video, so I had to tape it up so I can re show you guys what we got. And one more. So. I got this from Hard Motorsports. Um, it's a door panel de delete for the BMW E46, which is gonna make it look so much cleaner. It's gonna tie the entire car together. Cool part is like I can mount my. You can mount all the things right here. Um, I'm gonna be mounting my door lock and my speaker right here, and it's going to have the strap to actually close the door, since there's no more gonna be that little bar or uh, armrest right over here. So I'm excited, let's take a look at it and let's get this on the car. So just so you guys can see, the interior of the car looks pretty phenomenal. I just gotta replace the new seats later on. Uh, what we're actually gonna be doing, we're actually doing a door panel delete. We're actually removing this door panel and that door panel. It's gonna become a full drift spec build now. So first thing that we gotta do, we do gotta remove this door panel so we can actually put the new one on of course. Just gonna be one screw here, another screw down on the bottom, one more here, and one more here, and the last one's gonna be within this little airbag place. As you guys can see, this door panel is literally disgusting and worn out, and I just wanna make this look a lot cleaner. Okay, so I got the door panel removed, put it right here. Um, I removed the door handle with this uh, tweeter right here. It was held in with three of the Torque 20 screws. So remove that and I just transferred it to this. I am transferring the tweeter just cause so I have it. Just so you can see I mounted the door. I'm gonna go ahead and mount the strap so that way I got that squared away. Now we're mounting the actual strap to pull on to actually close the door. So what I had to do, I had to lift off this insulation. There was this silver or I guess tannish color piece actually where the actual original door panel would go through and from there you actually mount the hardware all right so now the strap is fully timed and it's actually tied to the frame which is a good thing so i'm going to push all this um, insulation back on so that way it sticks and then now we just got to put on these standoff screws or i get these nuts and then from there we just got to drill holes into the, the the new door panel and screw it back in and then we should be set Okay, so, so sorry for not keeping you guys up to date, but finally got the door panel in. This was pretty painful. Like, I was very confused on how to put this in. I had to drill a hole here, so that way the actual car locks. I still don't know, but I only got one, two, three, four. Um, I got the strap in, it's actually tied to the actual frame, which is good. But the only thing is, I can't get this one, two, and the third uh, bolt in. I'm probably trying to contact them, but like, it's still close. It's still pretty tight. Not that bad. It's pretty good. It was very confusing because I had to take off again the um, the liner. And then said, sorry, it's pretty sunny. This would go behind the frame. And then this little uh, standoff screw we go uh, from that nut on my left to this, and then it would be screwed in to like this from the outside. It was very confusing. I was like, I have no idea what I'm doing. Then I had to drill the holes. Wasn't too bad. Overall, looks pretty, pretty killer. I like it. Now, I just gotta go do that side again. This looks a lot cleaner, especially for a drift build. So, let's go ahead and try. Try this out. We close it. Nice. Looks a lot cleaner. Again, car opens. Cool. Perfect. All right, fellas. So just I got the passenger one done. Got the driver one done. It tugs really well. So that's gonna be it for installing these uh, door panels. I like it. It actually turned out really well. Alright guys, that's basically it for today's video. Hope you guys enjoyed it. Um, the car looks a lot better, a lot cleaner, especially now with the, with the door panel delete. Uh, please share, subscribe, like, and we'll catch you guys in the next video. See you guys.